and she's jumping in the back, but so you can't see her. Oh, yeah, no. Can. Anyway. You can see my eyes. Okay, could you? Okay, so today, today, I did this my birthday haul, as you guys remember. That video was quite successful, so I'm, this is not really part two or anything, but today I'm doing my collective haul for September, the, the end of September, the whole of October, and the beginning of November. So, I'm going to show you every Disney item I got, and one item at the end is a Disney lyric, but I want to show you it to you guys. And I'm going to talk a bit about, I might stand up at some point just because because and Holly's gonna be helping me at points in the video she might go off she's actually playing Roblox in the back over there so or there as you'll see and guys if you didn't know it's Steam Salon yeah or you can say anyway so we're gonna start with a collection I bought like with my birthday money we're gonna start with the stuff I got with my birthday money so of course you get money for your birthday and all that then you go get the stuff with your money well, that you didn't that get that you wanted Okay, then you go get the items you wanted for your birthday or Christmas, but you didn't get it. That's how it all works. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah, we're going to start with the best friend of collection, which is the big one. I can't find one of the figures. I, I looked so hardly, and I did not find it, so I'm just going to show you them. These would have been in a video, a uh, gap of a few ago, but I cancelled that series because... Because it was just like, I'm just going to play Roblox in front of you in these videos, so it's not like that. So yeah, at the end we're going to show you something big. I kind of revealed it in my last video, but I'm not telling you what the big thing is. But I kind of revealed it in my last video, unless you go see the last video. Or you wait till the end of this video, whatever you want. So yeah, let's not talk it down and just show the first figure. It's Lumaire. He's a candelabra. He sings. <laughs> Anyway, he's really cool. I like. I don't really get the position. I guess he's going to like. I guess it's like a seed. Okay. Okay, so we went to the dentist today, and Holly had. And um, guys, my tooth. This one was taken out here. Anyway, let me just hold it still. Oh <laughs> god, I can't hold it. I just dropped it like you want. Anyway, I like it. He looks just like in the movie. I really like how they did this figure. I like like the outfit, like the outfit. And of course he is a candelabra, not just a candle, and he is the head of the castle staff. Now we have his best friend, Cosworth. He's super, super cool. He's like a round clock. I love this figure so much. He's probably my favourite from the line of what they did. As you guys know, my birthday, I unboxed the Beauty and the Beast Funko Mystery Minis. And Cosworth wasn't in though. And spoilers, I didn't get the Matt and Chip. They were the two and a wedding dress now. It was kind of weird who some of them I got because I got a hot topic exclusive who I can't get here, which is cool. Yeah. This is not yeah. Cute. I love these figures together. They can. Oh, three, four, five. Okay, I'm starting this. Cosworth does have this line of be our guest when he like, stabs the top of the palace. Like Audrey. Audrey. Because she's got Audrey. Here. Okay. And then, yeah, then next we have, she's a teapot, she sings us a big news called Amber. She looks like an old grandma, but it's okay. We have Mrs. Potts. Save us all this time, everybody. Okay. Yeah, she's really, like, plump on these edges. Nice, he looks, she, she's really cool. And of course, she would curse us a teapot. And she, I like her a bit... Of course, Anna Lansbury can never beat her, but I like her kind of character arc in this film. But the act, Emma Thompson wasn't the strongest actress for her, but I like it. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, then next we have her son, Chip. He's young. He doesn't know about love. <laughs> but anyway, he's a cop. He's in a weird position, which is why I don't like him. He's like took to the side. He does sad. But yeah. Off to the cupboard with me now, Chip. If I like it, though. Okay. <laughs> that was kind of fun. So, anyway, yeah. It also came with a plumette who just looks really weird. Let's just imagine I have plumette in my hand. She looks so weird. Anyway, she is really weird if you've got the collection or you look at it online. She's not very good. So, yeah, I couldn't find her. So, she's not going to be this video. Then I went. Also, in that shop, I actually got this in the after in Cleveland. I got some other things in this Jimmy, in that shop. Lewis, do you wanna see my outfit? No, I'm doing this. Okay. You guys I have wait. 
Okay, so you guys know I have books of Disney Costco figures, and they were really cool. And I'm going to be showing you the Disney Costco plushies. They did plushies for the line, and they were one pound. I can't believe that. One pound. That was literally the best price ever. I did, I did get some Zoom Zooms. I did get the Jar Jar Big Zoom Zoom and some other Star Wars characters, but I couldn't be bothered to go get them. So we just, I got Jar Jar Big Zoom. Okay. First up, he's a mouse. He's Mickey Mouse. I'm so disappointed. Disney Costume still doesn't have the update, which is sad. But okay. Da, 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 da. I like this figure though. I actually got Mickey Mouse in the little figures when I opened the box and we found Mickey, so that was really cool. Anybody so, yeah. gonna take me and I like it they had these tags. They turned it name. So if you didn't know this was Mickey Mouse, which I have no idea how you did It was the first character ever made in Disney, we're pretty sure. No, he wasn't Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. One of them. Like But he was stole by Charles Mitt. You guys yeah, all know. Some like, people know that story. Anyway, we're not gonna. Yeah, we're not, yeah. This video's not the history of Mickey Mouse, but no, uh, he's not. he is really cool. Uh, I'll tell you later. Okay. Mickey, uh, he looks really cool. He's the mouse who started the one that started it all. So it's pretty cool. It's probably talking in the back. The mini mouse. I forgot to take this tag thing off. I really, I really like this Minnie Mouse though, it's, she's pretty cute, but she's polka dotted. I remember her from Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Okay, but we, okay, so the next person is Baymax. Hi, I'm Baymax, your person. We didn't get him in the toys, unfortunately. We found Minnie, but we did find these other three characters, I'm sure. But Baymax, he looks really weird. I have a big Baymax plushie, if you oh, saw my teddy videos. So cool. If you I saw my teddy bear video collection, and then once again it says his name, if in case you didn't know. Holly's back. Okay, next up, I've been really getting into, like, Toy Story. <laughs> She's so hyper. I don't know why. Hey, anyway, first up is Woody. You got a friend at me. He's a cowboy. What more do you get? He does look kind of creepy though. Look, look at those eyes. Uh... <laughs> I don't know why I did that. But I love this hat. Really cool. The legs. I'm going to giddy up like a cowboy. It's really been so long just talking about one thing at a time. Anyway, this might be a longer video. I'm going to get this into one part no matter what happens. Oh god. Okay, we have Buzz Lightyear. He's a space ranger. Because in the 80s, apparently kids liked space toys more than rodeo. 50s toys. And nowadays, they're all into fantasy. I guess that's the point. That's, what, that's the evolution of things that kids have liked. Nowadays, they can like anything. They can go from Barbie to Hot Wheels to... But they all have to do with fantasy and make-believe and stuff. So, yeah. But Buzz, of course, named after Buzz Aldrin, the second man on the moon. <laughs> Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear's his name. Can it tell you? But, but anyway, he's a really cool superhero. I keep saying anyway, not anyway. <laughs> I said it again. Oh my God. Someone, give me a Okay, another. B so. Another Beauty and the Beast that I found. I found this set and I was like, oh my god. This set has two characters. This character has two. This set has two characters who don't get much merchandise. And I had to, I have to pretend someone, someone else that in my games. Um, oh my god, I can't believe I found that. But first of all, I'll show you those in a minute. But first we have. Probably my least favorite set. This Pramette looks so nice, if you look at it, like, oh my god, look at her feather, that is so pretty, look at the shine, I don't know if we're catching it, but real life that's really cool. One complaint, Lumet's not like it, like this, he only turns differently, he turns to solid, spoilers, if you haven't seen the movie, but it's on DVD now, so go get it, it was a good movie, or well, I think it was, I like what her wigs, the, beast the, the new Beast of the Beast, oh yeah. I really, really I like it. I really like how, like, 
It reminds me of the scene in what it's called, um, Days of the Sun, where Kadan's like, Where are you? That's what he's singing. Then they sing at the end, and they're like dancing together. Like, they wish they were. But Lupe is the countdown to stomach. He looks like he's the most human. Like, this looks human. I wish these were detached so I could use this for better instead of that stupid other one. It just looks weird. But uh, yeah. But next up we have the Beast. They I, they did this other set that was made by Hasbro, who also made the Best Friend Collection. This was the exclusive to Toys Last, but not many people picked up, which was sad. I'm hoping you got if you point. You've probably never seen this set before, so it was a Toys R Us exclusive. I've only seen it in the UK, and I've only seen it in one store, which is the store I bought it in. They had two left when I got it. So. I love these sets, they come in like the round box thing. But yeah, Beast, he looks like Dad Steven. He looks, he looks like he wants to dance. I really like the coat. He has a golden style. It's golden. It's golden. It's golden. <laughs> uh, anyway. So, I like his horde, so like, it might stab you, but it doesn't hurt. I'm the one who, okay. I love the song Evermore, yeah. but I, I love the song How Does It Won't Last Forever too. The Beauty and the Beast new song, I really like them. All three of them are really cool. But Beast has a really cool cloak. And a really cool cloak. This one, I'm very disappointed. And the most amazing ever what's a looking figure ever. Not. Don't like. This just doesn't capture Emma Watson enough. No toy will ever capture on Emma Watson like her. I'm sorry, but. I do like her dress, but it's, it looks a bit weird how it's like all this bigness than just this thing. Like, it feels like if I was wearing that and it was this heavy, it would probably like. It's too heavy at the bottom. How does she dance with this thing? Like, I do like how they go together because then it covers the face, which is. Then you just see the gorgeous dress. And yeah, the only problem. Uh, the hair is really weird. This is what she looks like horizontally. Oh my god. Okay, now the two cards I'm so excited. The first one is Cadenza. Oh my god. Cadenza does not get enough fame. Stanley Tucci was so, so good at that role. Oh my god. I loved his character. He's really cool. He's the wife of the wardrobe guardo and he's really cool. He's a piano. I know he's like a different colour in the film, but I don't care about that. I love his look so much. He looks so cool. And yeah, he's awesome. Anyway, then finally for the set, we have Gardero. Oh, hi. Okay. That's like, that was like a second of my best Gardero impression. Yeah, I can't do an impression of her. Anyway, she's so cool. I love how they include her. She's a wardrobe. I thought she would be like a harder material, but she's just plastic, which is cool. And that means she's not like, she's not metal, like, I thought she would break easily, but no, she doesn't. But it says like printed. It, oh, it's made by. It was made by Jack. So Jack made this, and it was a Toys R Us exclusive. I don't, and I've only seen it in one shop, so this was very rare set. But if you bought it, if you saw it in stores and you bought, bought this, you're lucky, because this is quite a rare set. Okay, the next, I've got so, I got, unless, back when I was like, you won't be lucky if you don't like the set. <laughs> but you could sell it, like, five, ten years time, and I'd be like, I don't even know that set. I'd be like, Garnero, she was a great character. Anyway, I've been getting back into Toy Story collecting when I was really young, um, like, two or three. I collected everything Toy Story, I loved it's it. It was like, coat. it was like, Seriously. it was like, it was like, it was like a connection, like how adults and coffee, like that kind of connection. I love Toy Story so much. I Toy Story three was always my favorite because I came out. I was born in two thousand and seven. The film came out in two thousand and ten. I watched it in about like two thousand and eleven. I didn't see it in cinemas, but I was about four or five. I was four when it came, three or four when it came out. 
I don't think I watched it with a photo app. I, I watched it like a year after and I loved it. I always wanted there to be a thought movie where they did more with Bonnie. I really want it. I'm so excited for Toy Story 4. But anyway, she looks so cool. This is the Puss Pools one because Disney Store teddies are cool, but they're so expensive. This was £7, yeah. pounds, mind though, because that's, that's, that's not... And they don't say their tag. Here's what the tag looks like. The same Zoom Zoom Clinton tag because they're made by the same company. So, anyway, she has some weird material and uh, really weird. But this is Jessie. I, I, I have Bullseye already. I originally picked up Woody, Buzz and Jessie, these kind. But that was so expensive. And anyway, then we found these Disney Crossing off and they were like a pound each. I don't need two brothers and two Woody. Let's put them back. Let's budget. Then I was able Then I was able to get this set with the weird animal Watson. We need to get through these things quickly because we this has been a very long video. <laughs> oh god. And next we have who likes back to school? Me! Of course we all went back to school. The good people all went back to school. So I got myself a Beauty and the Beast pencil case that I have not filled, which I need to fill. If you look inside, there's not much inside. But the thing is really cool because it's like a road. I need to fill this with school supplies, right? A pencil, a pen, and life will be way better. Not. Anyway. That was a bit of a joke, because we didn't know. <laughs> I was being a bit sarcastic there, but anyway. Really cool. It's like a hard like, material round these, and it's like, like, if you look, it's like a hard material. But yeah, anyway, it says, if you can't read, which I think everyone on my channel can read, but if you can't, I will read these out. It says, find the heart. Oh, how lovely. Or get lost in a book. Would you rather find a heart or get lost in a book? Me, I would find a heart because I get lost in books every day. I don't need to like magically use magic to get lost in a book. Doesn't need to happen. <laughs> so we've gone past September. Now let's go into October. Everyone's favourite season, Halloween. And October, it gets all scary because everyone decorates for Halloween and it looks all cool. We didn't, but yeah. we did go trick or treating and we got so much candy. Too much, in fact. So I'm doing this least favourite to favourite. So, so, my least favourite. But this is the. Oh, yeah, this is the. Disney Things of Unicorn Collection. This was such a cool collection. I don't normally get the full set just because one money, two some of the characters just don't look good. It's only happened twice before this where I got the full collection. That was from Finding Nemo and Tangled the Series. So, yeah, but I'm getting these. So, first off, my least favourite, I don't like the colours on this one, see? Minnie Mouse as a unicorn. It's Minnie Mouse. But guess what? Have you guessed what's different about her from other mini masters? She's a unicorn, yay! I right, yeah, let's talk about her. She's a pink pair. I don't like this colour. It's not bright enough. I don't mind pink, but I don't really like this colour pink. So the unicorn horn's really cool. It's like really cool colour. Like I like her yellow, but it's not the bright yellow, like a different character this set. Then you have the gigantic Disney store tag. That you like to fold under the suit because they look horrible. They just dangle, 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 dangle. <laughs> I love this video, it's just a joke because it's just a bit more funner. I can believe I can fly. <laughs> I like, they have like cute marks. Hers is all about I can fly, like star power. Star power. You can look. Holly's back. Oh, yeah. Next, we have my other. It's a purple. I love this purple colour, but it's a character. I don't like how they keep doing these characters. I have two characters they should have done, but they didn't. But you're bad big as a unicorn. And, and this one's going a bit far, but I think it would have been really cool to see. Like, 
a brand new character as a unicorn, like, so we can see from the set, like, like, for instance, take a little set. Take a little set we did. Let me try and think of one. Anyway, I'm trying to think of a little set we did recently. A tiny little set. Of it. I can't even think of one, but take a character for a very short set that they didn't do it, then put it in a unicorn costume, look, make it look cute, then you have the best of it. I heard a heart. Next up, I love this cream colour, but the cat. Marie's a really good pick because, once again, she doesn't get many things soon, but yeah. Once again, the unicorn hold the same, same design, except she's a different colour. And the long dangly tags, same. Then finally, I love this colour the most. It's this blue, I love this blue. It's like a turquoise colour, I love turquoise, it's my favourite colour, so cool. She looks a bit like a hippo. <laughs> I really like that word. Yeah, if you take away the unicorn horn and the mm. wings and the tail, they look a bit mm. like hippos. Like the face What's that in the corner? That's your out. Oh, she chewed. Okay. I'm not chewing a pen, I'm putting it together. Oh. And then her, it's a flower, because she likes to plant flowers, apparently. Yeah, and these two are two characters who are unicorns in Disney Pixar, who are super cool to have. First up. Wow. Everyone's favourite character from the time out, or everyone's cat the, the side characters that everyone remembers. You know, take a Disney film like Toy Story. How many people remember? How many people remember Chun or Shred? How many people remember them? Or take another Pixar film like, for instance, Finding Dory. Who really remembers Beck? Not Becky. Fluke, not Fluke. They were like main character. What was like a side character? In that film. Who really, who really remembers? I can't, I can't think of the cat. Who really remembers that clam character? I'll take me to the beast. Who really remembers Fru Fru? No one. But everyone knows this rainbow unicorn. She looks so cool. She has a rainbow tail, the dangly tag, which is so dangly, weird horn, and ears, and red hair, because everyone wants to be Ariel. Coffee. <laughs> that was funny. Then the final thing for that collection was the rare bug. Why did I say rare? She's not very rare, is she? My favourite I lo I really want there to be another Toy Story Zoom Zoom connection with character with this doll. And I think they're going that way with this character than with the recent Tower of Te not Tower of Tower, what was it? Space Mountain? Or was it called? Tomorrowland. Yeah, Tomorrowland. They had the Alien with the Claw and the really cool Empersurg, which I'm so, I so wish the UK did that and it wasn't just the Disney Parks. But yeah, I love Buttercup. Now, next up, I'm kind of rushing a little bit. No, I think you didn't buy the stupid hat, I was going to buy it. Oh yeah, I, I spent 23 minutes by accident. I thought I thought he spent 3 actually. I love that, this little hat. I thought it would be cool for her to have it. It's actually five minutes and I purchased it and I was like, oh no, whoops. Now we have, okay. So, next up we have more Toy Story figures. First, not more, more figures. That'd be, that would Toy Story this time. First up, he's a cowboy. In this rodeo, he's also Woody the Cowboy. He has brown hair. He has a hat. I kind of like how they include that. I love these little sets that they do. So yeah. Woody. Okay. Next up is Jessie. She's a cowgirl. These are not a couple though. Cowboy and cowgirl doesn't make couple. She is in love with Buzz. And he's in love with the character. He didn't come in the set. Bo Peep. Yeah. He wants Seamus Gordon. But, you know, that's a shame it's really nice when people call Woody and Jesse a couple. Not a couple. Not a couple. Oh my god. Okay, next up we have Buzz. He's a space ranger and he's ready to fight the evil Emperor Or not so. Or the Prospector. I'm just saying hello to guys. Okay. Hello. 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 Buzz has a really cool jetpack to infinity and beyond. Can't do an impression of him, but 
he just both rage, yeah, that's all you've got to know, and I nearly dropped it. Next up, a character I didn't expect to be in the set, Bullseye. Giddy up, Bullseye. No, that joke's old. Okay, he's a horse, he's Woody's horse. They ride together, they had a good time, but I really like, I really like the posies here, it's really cool. And then next up, the only repeat, because I already had a replica, but it was different. Mama, I really want that toy doll. We already have one, sweetie. No, it's different. <laughs> that's li that's no, what most mothers think of. When the kids want something that they already have, it's a bit different, yes? Wow. Okay. Rex is really cool. I really like his face. I don't get the colour, though. Like, here, like this yellow colour. It looks like someone, like, put mixed up. Then finally, my favourite... He's the most lovable teddy bear. Not. He's not so. He's so mean. Everyone hates him. He has a stick. <laughs> when the kids get old, the new ones replace that. When they get old, no. Okay. And now for the big reveal, which I revealed in yesterday's video. The other day's video. I can't remember what day it was. Da, 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 Two micro suits advent calendar. Why two? People ask. I thought the limit was one. Well, we went to this pop up. Why we? We went to this pop up store. You see. Well, we heard of a pop up store in Crew Corporation that we had no idea existed. So we went up there. Well, my road dad went up there without me. Got some Christmas presents. I've got two calendars. But don't worry, we're not gonna be opening one, but two. We're selling one on eBay, because that's what the good people do. Which one will sell it on eBay? The world they never know. One of these is going on eBay. If you want to win, you can go try and go to eBay and try and find it. I don't know how to put a link, so I can't put any link or anything, but yeah. Unless you find it. One of these, I'm keeping a course. Put a link whenever you find I'm gonna be, it. I don't know if I'm no, going to do it. Put a link whenever you find it. I, I have no idea how, so I can't. But okay. Do do? Okay. But anyway, these two, these two calendars are so cool. But what disappointment with this? I'm just gonna show what. What disappointment? The last one had like Mickey and Minnie on the side. This one just says three, three things are gonna call. You have day one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, all the way to twenty-five. Not 24, like most calendars do. And these, it doesn't come with little chocolate in the suit. This one's the one I'm keeping, actually. Yeah. My You know that school? Yeah, what's. Okay, you can tell me all about that later, I guess. Um, the guys have got to know us that, do they? Anyway, so finally, this is not Disney related, but I wanted to show it to you guys. It's a colouring book I got. You, when you see the title, you'll say, this is an adult colouring book. Are you an adult? I go, no. You're like, why do you have this colouring book? Because I like adult colouring. It doesn't say that you have to be an adult. Now, does it? Okay, here's, you can get a bunch of peas. You can get a bunch of peas, but I've, okay. I've, I've kind of did a whole one, and I've started another one. I want to show you them. I'm just flipping through my book, because these pages actually look kind of cute. One of them took, this one took me forever, but I've done this one. You can say my colour is horrible. I don't care. I like I like it. I use different colours. I like the castle. I like this tree. And there's the bushing. It looks pretty cool. What do you think? Say in the comments. Yeah. Now, now I'm going to show you the other one I started. I started this one. I haven't done it, of course. Yet. I have a long way to go. But it looks like a little troll. It's pretty cool. But I just wanted to show that because I really like adult colour it. And it's pretty cool. So, yeah. We're going to end this off just once again. I'm just gonna move this chair. I've been sat in this chair for the whole video. I'm gonna move it just to do the outro. So, 
calendar. We're selling one on eBay. I'm not giving it away for Christmas because we're giving away a different Zoom Zoom item for Christmas. We're doing a Christmas giveaway, of course. We're giving away the freaking Zoom Zoom. Everyone knows that. But, yay! And, um, and thank you guys so much for watching this kind of, I don't know, more sarcastic kind of video. I hope you liked it. It was 30 minutes.